How you doing guys, this is Magna from Joy NYC and I'm gonna show you how to load Final Fantasy Mod 7 on your Samsung Captivate. Alright, first things first, we're going to settings, applications, development, and then we hit USB debugging. You gotta make sure that's on. Now we go back. Now the following files you need to have downloaded to your computer. One of these files, the CM Captivate MTD for 181, or whatever number it may be, the most updated one, you need to put it on your phone. I have already done that, so you need to do that and put it on the main main memory and the main SD card. From here, what we can do is we plug in our USB. Then we'll make sure USB debugging is connected and the whole USB shows up on your computer. Now once on the computer, make sure you open command prompt and you get to the ADB of the SDK package you downloaded from the, the link below. That will be the developer's link. Android developers link. From here, I'm going to show you how you can reboot your phone while using your USB and using command prompt without using any other equipment or using any three like button combo. As you can see, I type in ADB, reboot, download. This will put our phone into download mode. Once I hit enter, you can see that the phone will be rebooting. And there we go. We're in download mode. Now, for this to work, you gotta make sure that your phone is rec is recognized with the computer. Because if it's not, it will not work. After you put your phone in download mode, make sure you open up Odin. And once you open up Odin, you gotta make sure that there's a yellow box that shows that your phone has been connected and recognized while in download mode make sure you check off auto reboot and then click on PDA button on the right now from here we're gonna go and look for for the speed mod kernel which is for the captivate and once all this is in place make sure you take a look and your screen should look like mine and make sure your phone is recognized. You click start. Now after you click start, you do not want to turn off your phone and you do not want to take off the USB cable. This is pretty fast, it's pretty quick and once you get the green pass box, you're good to go. Once the last separation is done, you gotta make sure you gotta make sure you do a battery pull and then put it back in there and just go ahead and turn it on. Now if you do have the three button combo, you can go ahead and access the recovery mode. However, if you do not have the three button combo, you can go ahead and do what I'm about to show you, which is basically going into recovery mode the same way you went into download mode with the ADB from the SDK Android that we have downloaded. Now we gotta make sure that our phone is still recognized. And we gotta make sure it's still in debugging mode. After that, as you can see, our phone is recognized. So we go ahead and type in ADB space reboot space recovery. And once I hit enter, you will see the phone go into recovery mode.
as you can see, we got into recovery mode. And we're in clockwork mode recovery. Now from here, we got to make sure we go into install the zip from the SD card, which you can't really see, but you click on there, and then you choose zip from the SD card. Now remember, our CM Captivate file will be on the, S on the phone SD card, not external S SD card. From there, you go into it and click it, then the next menu is going to pop out asking if you want to install it or not. You got to make sure you click yes, and from there it will just leave the phone do its magic. Now this process may take a little bit, but once Hanager Mod 7 is installed, this is what your screen should look like. You just gotta give it a second to load up. It's a bit faster than last time with Froyo. And here is the phone. I will show you that we have actually installed Signage Mod 7 under settings. And now you need to be aware that Signage Mod 7 does not come with Google Apps. If you want to install Google Apps like Market or Gmail, you can follow my next video which is how to install Google Apps on your phone. But as far as this goes, there's no Google Apps on here. But the phone will still work as long as you have a SIM card. Well, this is Jordan NYC, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. What happened to the funny paper?